Hey, welcome back to another video. So for today's video, what I want to do is um, I bought a couple packs of these last year and then I have the larger ones. The bigger ones, they kind of suck because they don't have a lot of power, but um, oops, I forgot to tell you guys what I was going to do. So uh, these Texas Pop Rockets, they're like old school. Everybody knows them. Um, they're like been around for a long time. So sometimes what I do is to make these better, I'll actually put some black powder in there to further extend the rocket because these guys here are in burners that's why they have the little fuse um, with some stuff and then the clays in there so these aren't cord rockets none of these are like that and, and not a lot either to prove that I'll just grab a regular rammer this isn't the right size but we'll see okay and right there so that and then you have the end burner here. The clay is usually about that much. So you only have like about an inch and a half worth of uh, black powder. So what you could do to make these better is you can actually pack more in there and then um, make them better to last, you know, twice the amount of power. Uh, you take like a wooden rammer like this and that should fit in there. Yeah, that fits in there nicely. Um, it, it is not a half inch because the half inch is actually a little bit too big. Yeah. So it's a 3 8 is what it is. I was gonna buy the 3 8 tooling, which would have given me a 3 8 rammer, but I didn't. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pack a little bit more black powder in there and make it better. And I wanted to show you guys what was inside. So this is what makes your Pop Rocket a report. Um, thank you for that suggestion. I totally forgot about that on my last video. I couldn't think of the term, but uh, the report is this little baby guys here. So the little lady fingers and they put a little bit of loose black powder in there so that way it ignites it and goes off. So what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna throw in some of my flash powder, throw a little plug in there, some hot glue up top, and I'm gonna make these a lot better. Okay, so we're gonna pretend that I don't have this flash here and I wanna say, yeah, this is the flash out of a five inch ball shell. So you could use this too, but I'm not gonna do that. So we'll pretend that I didn't have that flash powder and this would be like a person at home that's trying to make their um, Texas Pop Rockets better. You just bought some. So what we can do is we can take some of these uh, flash packers. And I think these, I got a brick of them last year for like 10 bucks or I can't remember. Um, but what we'll do is we'll just pull a couple off. Fuse comes right off pretty easily. And we'll do three for now. So we'll say you had a pack of these, let's just say, um, we'll break them up and you can kind of feel where that little clay is at and then you can feel where it gets real soft and that's right there is where the, uh, the fuse and the clay is at. So kind of knock that flash out there like this. And these have a decent amount of flash. It's not a lot, but then you got to make sure you don't put that brown in there, but a little bit of brown's okay. So you just kind of knock the flash out a little bit there. Make one without extra powder and then one with it and then we'll go from there. So take your little tiny funnel like that, put it up top and then I'm going to do this off camera because I don't have enough room to do all that because the sticks on there. All right, so I uh, went ahead and poured in this little bit of flash in there. Let me make sure I have the right one because I can't even tell which one I was using. Which is this one okay this one has a flash so i was thinking on the other one i'm just going to stick some of these in there and then see how that works out but these little tiny plugs won't work they're too small these are little half inch ones that i made the other day which are also a little bit too big so you just take a little piece of uh, napkin or toilet paper and you kind of ball it up that's a little bit too much just ball it up and you what you're doing is you're just making a small plug is all you're not doing much with it and you just leave that little gap in between there so that's about right so kind of plug it up what you want is you want to make build that pressure in there that's what's going to cause it to go off so I can feel that it's pretty tight with that so that's good kind of sorry I thought I was in camera make sure I'm in view so yeah kind of get that toilet paper press it in there like so and it's just awkward because it's a stupid stick like I can't mess with it i'll do it off camera 
And then all I did was pour some glue up top. I'm gonna set this somewhere, let it cool off. And then I'll do that for the next one. So pretty much it's the same process over and over. So you can make yourself some better ones like I showed in my ground bloom uh, video. It's the same thing. You just pretty much taking out what's already in there, adding and making it better. Um, if you wanted to, you can take a couple apart and throw more of these little baby fingers in there. Um, they're not that loud, that's the problem with them. And I don't wanna put any more black powder in there because it'll run out of room. So let's just see if this will fit. Yep, it fits. But the only crappy part is only one fits in there. So that's not gonna give you much, but these flash crackers do work pretty good. So it'll actually sound a little bit better. So I'll just throw a couple of these little guys in there. And then I'll throw one of these big ones in there. And yeah, that fits just like that. Pack that in there, nice and tight. Kind of get that in there. So that way that pressure builds and then get that flash cracker in there. Um, Another thing though is I may not even glue this because I do want it to go off, but I want the firework to pop out. I don't want it to um, go off inside of here because then it, I think what will happen is it will destroy everything and it won't work as I want it to. Um, one of the plans that I was thinking about doing is building a shell like the Cuete one that I made uh, with the bigger uh, header up top and then fill it with these. And then let those go off in the air so it's kind of like a cluster bomb type thing um, but I don't know I'll have to figure that out but anyways so that's pretty much gonna be it I'm gonna leave it like that so that way it pops open and hopefully lights off the little reports in there so this guy's already drying off so this is my flash one and then we'll do a regular black powder one flash and then this one and then kind of give you an idea of how they work but Yep, that's going to be it for this video. I uh, appreciate y'all for watching and until the next one.